It's my, my turn. It's your turn. Everyone's gonna die. I don't hear anything. 12, 26 a.m., May 28th, Little Hope Police Station. What do you think? Oh, there we go. Doubtful. Fuck you. I'm not so sure we'll find anything useful in here. It's derelict. You students are all the same. Doom, gloom, and negativity. Thank you for subscribing, Tad a Tentacle. All we need is one phone. Sorry. Just needed to fix one thing. Still be hooked up. Something up? Yeah, there's something kind of familiar about this place. These small town police stations all look the same. I wonder what all the scars on his face are from. If that's like a. There's got to be a phone in here Thank you for subscribing, place. Rubala, for six months. Much appreciated. Thank you, everyone. Thank you. Which guy? Are the younger guy? No, the older guy. He has a couple. Like, not that scars are something unusual, but I'm wondering if that's like a hint to like their previous history or something. I know. I think that's a good um, observation. Observation, because I think that maybe because remember the girl had those things on her neck. Yes. Oh yeah. I wonder if it has to yeah. do with how they originally died. Like maybe she was hung. Oh yeah, because it almost looks like a bullet wound on his cheek. Yeah, and maybe he was shot in the face, and maybe like, I don't know. Just that's how they all died. In different ways. No? Okay. Pull like this, maybe? I, I had to not close it. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Jump scares. Oh, Tatted Tentacle says, also, I had to sub because I think I owe you two P tax. <laughs> Ah, uh, the fetish tax. If you ever get aroused at, at a geek remix stream or video, you it's you should I mean, tip. if if you know if it's gonna make anybody feel like woo, my I have bare feet right now. Yeah, all those you can't titties. see them, but they're there. Oh yeah, we both don't have shoes on right now. <laughs> Just saying. Mm -hmm. This is a barefoot Contessa going on. <laughs> Wait, is she the racist one or is she? The, one of them, <coughs> one of them was racist, and the other one was cool. Which one? There was two no plus size idea. older women on the Food Network who had their own shows. One was Barefoot Contessa, and the other one was like, not that. What the one with the white hair was a racist. The one with the brown hair. Paula Dean. Paula Dean. She was the racist. The one who was like, and then we add more butter, and then. No, we no, no. The butter lady. She was not racist. No, that is absolutely no. The one with white hair. No, Maybe they both pa just... It's Paula Dean. Okay, Paula she's, Dean she's was the, the butter racist. lady. Okay, but there was another one, the Barefoot Contessa. I think she wasn't racist. And she... pa Paula Dean is the butter lady. Okay. The one who's like, and then we like put everything in a bag. Okay, both of the plus-sized older women both always said, put butter in it. <laughs> Barefoot Contessa was the one who wouldn't sign things for dying kids. <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> Okay, never mind. I guess all plus size women are problematic. Hi. Welcome. <laughs> oh, they. Did you see it called it hippie artifacts? When <laughs> you turned it over? TC. I don't want this. This is cute. Oh, hippie junk. <laughs> hippie artifacts. Hippie artifacts? But yeah, Paula Dina is like super, super racist. Okay, is the other one racist too? No idea. I just there was a. Any bets on which character is gonna die first? Oh, probably. Probably since some one of mine. All of them. Yeah, we're not killing them on purpose. But I am. We have a Very winner. Competent. Found a phone. This could be our way out. Line's dead. <coughs> See how he has like scar? Shit! Oh! Whoa! Hey! Take it easy. I'm thinking I know what's bits. wrong. Please do share. Love you too, says Walker Locker. There's no cable plugged in. I 
There's got to be a cable here someplace. So I put some effort, because everyone always says our videos are so quiet, so... So that guy picked up the phone, heard nothing, and immediately started breaking things instead of going, it's not plugged in. Yeah, is he, here's what is confusing <laughs> to me. The guy who found the phone didn't notice it wasn't plugged in. <laughs> you know what he did? He probably noticed it didn't plugged in. Thank you for the bits, Butter, which, Butter X, which much appreciated. 69. Are you a racist? Butter <laughs> Apparently Butter's racist. That's all I know. Um, but I much appreciate it. Thank you so much. I like that you picked 69 Keep looking. Gay But the guy who found it, he was all like, oh, we found a phone. The guy runs up, tries to use it. Meanwhile, he's thinking, oh, there's no cord. There's no cord! <laughs> ah! You know, but have you ever just had one of those days where your headphone cord gets stuck on something and you're like, why can't they? work and it's like the simplest thing yes. all you have to do is like unwrap it from the door thank you for the bits frozen mochi here's my discourse for 2021 is being is is butter racist because both plus size women on the food network who love butter wait all right i'm gonna pick look i don't want to slander this woman if she's not actually there are they both racist the, I, nobody said that about barefoot contessa they said that she wouldn't sign things for dying kids Paula Dean is for sure racist. Okay. Thank you for the bits, Soothsayer68. Okay, so she just wouldn't sign things for kids. Thank Dying you for, kids. For, for Soothsayer68. Okay. In that situation, you can be like, maybe it was just like a scheduling thing. <laughs> they but were, if they you... were dying. What kind of scheduling thing gets in the way of them? What is that? Oh. Put butter in it. Nice. This is gonna be like a call from the past, maybe. What do you think? Answer it. Yeah, I got this. Yeah, let's do it. I can do this. Be careful. What? Don't stress oh, it, it, Professor. Answer the ghost phone. I like how they both just accepted it as happening. Ghost phone. Ghost phone. They didn't even go. How is it happening? As <laughs> Sunday falsely accused. What can you hear? A woman. She sounds real upset. Talk to her. Try to get some details, her location, anything we can use to find her. Can I ask... What's your name? As I walked, a man appeared at my front. I reached out in fear. I had not seen him approach. This man I had never seen before, Clothes and manner of speaking when okay, it's all good. I'm gonna help you out here if I can, but I I need to know your name. <laughs> I've come falsely accused of That's the right lady. <laughs> Get off of me! Speak with I have a hard time seeing their faces. I cannot talk of our secret. Eternal damnation awaits if you do. We have an understanding, do we not? No evil word shall leave my lips. Should you breathe a word, or the edge of a word about the other things, then I will come to you in the black of some terrible night and bring a reckoning that will shudder you. Now, Reverend, let us begin. Enough time has gone begging. There's an Asian man here? Go be with you, kin. What? Wow, that's... I beseech this court, and good Judge Wyman, do not be fooled by the protestations of the accused. The devil is the master of deceit. All his servants feign <laughs> innocence. They can well, do little else. I solemnly swear before God, I am innocent of all accusations against me. Hush now, Amy. What the hell should we do? Shut up, dude. This is cool. We need to stay quiet. We just let this play out. See what happens. I mean no offense, Reverend Carver. I do not believe any of my neighbors, those who know me best will speak out against me. They know who I am, that I side with the righteous. I will not be caught in the web of your deception. 
The devil hides himself where he is least expected. My wife is no devil's plaything, Reverend. I beg the court's forgiveness. But I stand by my statement. My wife Amy is innocent. I respectfully ask this good court to pay no mind to the words of a man whose very home is foul with the stench of brimstone. I beg you, good judge, let us conclude our business here without further ado, lest we afford the forces of darkness the opportunity to bend these proceedings to their will. No! Mary? Mary, my sister, what ails you? What the? Stay out of this. What have you done to this child? You have bound an innocent girl into a pact with the devil himself. The poor creature seems possessed. No doubt you're doing. It's not true, Reverend. Why have you taken it against me, sir? We will the see the truth of it. Of her. Amy, Calm. lay your hands on Mary. Let us see what occurs. No if I am correct, your you touch no will no release demons. her from this affliction. What ails you? It must be so if you are the Is one who bewitched her. Leave her alone! Who speaks? Yeah, Who's there? God that preserve us. <laughs> Please, God. The master can I help you now. It is too late. They are here among us. They are here among us. No! What more proof is needed that the devil walks among us in little hole? <laughs> Take heed and pray. The devil is here oh, in this buried yeah. room. Protect that's yourselves. So is Seek that out the Lord. Dad? Uh Like did she make her dad play the role of like her brother? Huh. What the hell was that shit? Was that for real? Felt pretty damn real to me. Seriously? I feel like the ages don't change. Didn't the witch trials that? happen centuries ago? They had Most of them over then. 300 years True. ago. Then how come we just saw one? Like I say, I have no good explanation. That little girl who had some kind of seizure. What do you think was going on there? I know that little girl. She's the one me and Angela saw back in the woods. Accusations were often malicious, made by someone with a grudge. Or by meddling liars, like that little girl, who took perverse pleasure in poisoning their own communities. <laughs> she doesn't know. Come on. She's just some little kid, who most likely doesn't get how big a deal the whole thing is. She knows exactly how serious it is. Either way, the woman on trial Angela 2.0, she seemed like she saw us. And so did some of the others. A little kid just seeing us appear out of nowhere could easily believe that was witchcraft, especially back then. Dream up all the excuses you want for that little kid. I don't trust her one little bit. We can't explain how we happened to see each other. How do you expect some little girl from 300 years ago to wrap her head around it? The Thank woman you. we just saw condemned I saw her back at the intersection. I noticed something else weird. Her husband? He looked a lot like you, Professor. The two people with that little brat looked just like Daniel and Taylor. What the hell does all this mean? Who's that? Hey, Professor! You in there? Come on, let's go. Someone was saying that it, uh, they, uh, they think that they're siblings. Oh, okay. Because hey, Taylor, we're in here. Sister. We can't open the damn doors. Uh, we can't either. They must be locked. Jessica Jones Let's all it. try to force the handle. In three, two, one. Oh, oh Jessica Jones did. Taylor. Hey, Professor. 
Wait, so are the Find anything that could get us out of here? Nah, big fat nothing back there. Just a pile of junk. <laughs> are you okay? I know what happened. That other version of me was arrested, charged with witchcraft. She stood trial and was condemned for witchcraft. We need to know what that woman is facing. What's going to happen to her next? Her glasses I like have the lenses idea. and his don't. But how would we even begin to find that out? Oh, wait, they do. We've already been down those paths. Maybe the answer lies down the one path we haven't taken yet. It might just be what the, the hell? girl is a sister. And that's her boyfriend. Yeah. We keep they those two keep being in scenarios where they're brother and sister. No 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 no. This the two girls are sisters, and the boy is not. The boy, remember the first This is fucking crazy. Oh, he... We have no clue what we're getting ourselves into. The trial, the strange girl, Angela's double. Feels like it's all building towards something. Only question is, are we headed someplace good or bad? And bad is probably very, very bad. Yeah, the old uh, Taylor ex Angela. I'm kind of, are you talking about the young man with the older woman? No, oh. they're talking about the young woman and the older woman. <laughs> they both have short hair, it could work. <laughs> Okay, Stacey, in order for this to work, because I just moved and my controller thing <laughs> isn't, so you're just going to have to tell me what to do. Are okay. you okay with that? Yeah, that's fine. Who is she? What the hell does it mean that she's here? She can't be real. She has to be a manifestation. You mean the reason she's here is because you're here? You got a better explanation? I don't have an explanation. John says which trials really happened right here in Little Hope. He's right. I think they did. Then that woman was on trial hundreds of years before I got here. So how can I be manifesting her? Reincarnation? Reincarnation? Why not? You came back here because of her, because you once were her. And the rest of us? We're all reincarnated from these people and we happen to be at the same college on the same bus trip here? Like I said, I don't have an explanation. I'm just guessing is all. I mean, that's what we were theorizing, yes. Okay, they're so... They're reincarnated. The two people who have fucked in this timeline, are they brother and sister? <laughs> <laughs> I stick together, shit. Oh god, the what? walking is terrible. <laughs> this fog is getting worse. Uh, for people saying that they're adopted, that does not make it better in no, my mind. No, actually, when you guys argue that it's okay because they're adopted, you're actually worse. Yeah. I do not. I actually, you know what? I hope they are not adopted because that would be less creepy somehow in my Maybe mind. Maybe the fog was the reason for the diversion. We were uh, never meant to make it out of here. Yeah, as someone who has step-siblings, I'm not related to them, but like... Hooking up with them would be fucking weird and awful. Like, no. I'm sorry. I, people gotta stop saying shit like that. Like, I understand why people do say it. It's like, oh, they're step-siblings. Or, Woody Allen, that's his adopted daughter. And I'm just sitting there well, thinking, like, so you think it's okay for men to adopt their do would adopt little girls and then marry them? Is that That's literally what you just told me. Mm -hmm. You think that it's okay for men, adult men, to adopt children girls so and then marry them the whole thing about incest is that if you have kids and you're blood related there's chances of birth defects i can't see so, for shit but that's not really the grossest part of it for me oh! jesus the water looks black i don't want to go anywhere near it like it's gross because you are raised as siblings or family members and then you get together. That's like, that's the part that, you know, just cause You're it's supposed to be able to depend on them okay. as a family member Who's who first will up? never do that huh. to you. Mm -hmm. Professor, you keep telling us you're in charge, so. What do you want? Oh, uncertain. Maybe we need to check all our other options first. Andrew, down. Right. Thought so. <laughs> Fuck yeah. 
Everyone's pissed already. I love it. I want off this bridge as fast as possible. But not that fast. Someone has to go first. I you leave. I'll be right behind you. I think the body that was like running around, that gross one, I think that's her body. Oh yeah. Um, the older lady's like body. Like the like the witch. Oh yeah. yeah the, because the, she was the, probably the drowned, oh. drowned, and they were like, if she's made of wood, she's a, she's a witch. Mm -hmm. And huh? then they're like, she's a dog. <laughs> We can't stay here. In this year of our Lord, 1692, we are here present to bear witness to a just execution. No! Shit. Amy is declared guilty of consorting with the devil and is to be drowned as a witch and sorceress. Let us pray in silence for her soul. I've done no wrong. I am no witch. I do not deserve death. I beg you. What's going on? Why, why do you look like Angela? Your words have little meaning to me, but I beg you. Help me. Whoa. The devil is in the wind, seeking to help his own. He would release her from the chains. Isaac, let us conclude our business here swiftly. The will of the court must be imposed before it's too late. The devil fortifies her. You must bind her tightly. The law and religion coming together to fuck everyone over again. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you cannot do this! Isaac, I am innocent. fulfill the will of the court. Send this witch back into the lap of her master, lest he comfort Do us it. all. Little Hope is already lost, shrouded in evil. But not as you claim from witchcraft or outside demons, we are poison from within. You will not save yourself with riddles. There is no riddle. The devil takes many forms. You know that better than any. In Little Hope, he has hid himself under a shroud of innocence, taken the form of a child by accuser. While oh. Mary still draws breath, little hope remains beyond salvation. Oh, okay. Mary, Mary really does have a demon friend. Be you know your that. very fix. Yeah. And she's allowed Isaac. that. Oh. I think the Reverend is the evil guy, obviously. But I think he's, it's, they're implying that he's doing something like pedo to Mary, but yes. I think what he's actually been doing is like summoning demons of Mary. Oh, yeah. Because like, maybe he wants power. First of, I, I just don't want to deal with a pedo story. Second, you know, it'd be cool if he was just like summoning demons with her or something. I feel like that would make more sense for the story. Because yeah. Because if you would, because it's like, oh, maybe she summoned a actually, demon to what protect did she herself. See? Tell it's me. It's like, ah, oh, we've heard that. Yeah. I don't know how to tell you what I just saw. Sorrowful. Your double was pushed into the river in chains. She drowned. Oh. Mari, your turn. Yay! So are we almost done? I, I heard someone say that, but I don't remember. Oh, All right, I'll go we first. We for like two hours, so I don't know. I don't know. I was asking. I thought it was like five hours. Oh, it is? So I thought it was three, so I don't know. Oh, I'm not sure. Okay, you two, get on down here. If it's five hours, I'm excited for that. Yeah. We're, we're still, still pretty, early in the game? Uh, okay, great. <sighs> We're like one third of the way through. Or half of oh, the perfect. Yeah. I'm so happy to hear that. Oh, this did not look good. Oh my god, it's an animation from a 1993 
Oh, what the hell is that? What is that thing? Get away from it! Run! Get the hell out of there! Look out! Shit! Don't leave me behind! Hey! Give me a hand here! What do you want me to do? Oh, this is my turn. Hold yeah. on, hold on! Oh, no. I'm coming back for you, John. Hold on. John sucks, first of all. Reach up and grab you. my hand. Yeah. You're not getting back victimized again, girl. Come on, Andrew. Jump up and grab onto me. Okay, I, I trust you. Phew, that was really quite close for Angela. She was almost lost to a fate worse than death. Not that there's anything particularly wrong with death. <laughs> well done. Not a soul lost so far. Things could have been quite different. As the stakes seem to have been elevated, that gun might prove to be a lifesaver, don't you think? So far. Or the precise opposite? <laughs> Andrew is keeping it quiet. Good move. Look after number one, right? <laughs> I love his whole deal. The boys have some interesting theories. Could they, as Andrew has suggested, be the reincarnated souls of their historical counterparts? Or maybe you're choosing to believe Daniel's theory, that they're already dead. My dream was lengthened after life. Oh, then began the tempest to my soul. I passed, methought, the melancholy flood with that sour ferryman, which poets write of unto the kingdom of perpetual night. <laughs> it's possible, I suppose. Maybe the bus driver can shed some light. This must be very confusing for you right now. Doppelgangers, witches, ghosts, death and demons. What could possibly tie all of these souls together? I dare say we'll find out, hmm? I have been granted permission to give you a single hint. Tempted? Uh, sure. <laughs> okay, then. We will once again turn to the Bard for some cryptic inspiration. I met him once, you know. I meet everybody. Once. Are you death? Uh, that's, yeah. Like, Cry <laughs> scene one, where Cleomenes begs Leontes Maybe to that's forgive like, himself for causing the death of Hermione. Do as the heavens have done. Forget your evil. With them, forgive yourself. Mm. So we're Go in on then. As terrifying as it might be, you should get back to it. So I guess what's keeping them there is guilt. It feels like almost like like we are the one who's passing judgment or so. Walk, walk the, the farthest. farthest. What? Chose most head decisions? Yeah, as in you kept your kept level-headed. I was trying to make people fight. Yeah. Well, 
Because all of that stuff that you did with that other guy, you chose the level-headed options. Oh, because I wanted to protect the little girl. Yeah. That's different. Even if the little girl is evil and full of demons, I'm like, she did nothing wrong. <laughs> okay, it's your turn. Ooh, look at her being all spry. Yeah, she's Wait. the am fucking living. John. This guy, just let him, let that guy die. I don't like him. What in the name of holy fuck was that? Yeah, I've never seen she's anything a survivor. Like it. it was like something from a nightmare. Did you see the way it looked? The gaping mouth, those dead soulless eyes. Whatever it was, it's gone now. I was nearly gone. If that thing had caught me, it was so close. You've had the crap scared out of you. We all have. But at least we got the fuck away from it. Irritable. <laughs> You saying I should be grateful? That I owe you for my life? No, chill. I I'm saying it all happened Don't so fast. Don't tell her fast. to chill. It's a good thing we all made it. Oh. <sighs> Angela, what's up? Is she gonna have some sort of scars or what's something? What's going on? That, like, like the, from the chain? Or... My legs felt like they were on fire. Oh. You okay? <sighs> Must be payback for all the climbing I did. That thing, whatever the fuck it was, is still out there. Could be hunting us as we speak. It was in chains. Just like the woman who went in the water. I don't believe that's coincidence. Either of you see what happened to Taylor and Daniel? They can't be far behind us. Do you see it? Let's just get out of here. It was oh. over her shoulder. Oh no. Yeah, you could see it for like a split second. Fuck. One thing I do like about this studio is the fact that they do that sometimes. Yeah, well, and they don't make, make everything like a <clears throat> Yeah, sometimes they just have something in the background staring at you, and I think that's fun. Can we keep moving? I don't feel safe here. What, you don't feel safe in the pet cemetery? <laughs> 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 Quick, bury something and see if it comes back. Here lies the oh. body of Abraham Alastor, died February 13th, 1699. Factum Fieri infectum non protest. So Guy Fieri infects us with protest. Mm. That's, mm -hmm. what, that's trans, what it says. That's the translation in that's, case anybody know doesn't means, know though. Latin. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> Exactly. Factum. Let's party like it's 1699. Theory. Theory. No, there's no reason to look it up. I'm pretty sure Stacy got it right. It is impossible for a deed to be undone. So also serves as a great reminder for your friends when they say they're about they're about to do something rash. Oh, so it's like the opposite of YOLO? Yeah, it's Nega YOLO. Yeah. Nega YOLO. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like it would be really fun to like translate stuff like that into like current yeah nega yolo nega yolo yeah don't be dumb or you die yeah <laughs> that thing is still coming for me it doesn't sound close we'll be fine if we keep moving I really hope you're right oh I don't know I just was clicking random no directions. I just didn't realize there were different paths so it's kind of I saw the possibility, so I thought, why not? Huh. You know what? It is still kind of like you only live once, but like, you only live once. You know? <laughs> <laughs> or do you? Or do you? Or do you keep on fucking living? All right, so there's this thing that's been fucking me up about... So there's this new expansion for World of Warcraft called Shadowlands, and basically you go to the underworld to save people because the afterlife is broken and everyone's going to hell instead of going to the different 
afterlives because mm-hmm. there's infinity afterlives basically to accommodate every belief mm-hmm. in the world but there's only one hell but <laughs> i mean that would be hellish everybody from all of the afterlives <laughs> all in one place yeah but there's only one hell like super hell super hell and all the other ones are like you know you either get to go to heaven or you go to a place where they try and rehabilitate you and or like if you're kind of a shitty person they punish you for a little bit and then you overcome your sins and shit mm-hmm. so like if you killed your children you still are rehabilitated, but if you're Hitler, you go to mega hell. You go to super hell. Yeah. Um, <laughs> it's basically if there's no hope for redemption of your soul, you go to mega hell. But the thing that's fucking me up is that essentially the day-to-day gameplay is the same, where you kind of just do, like, you have to pick up herbs and do this and do that. And I the whole time I'm thinking, why does this bother me so much? And it was it's because, oh, that's, we got to win in a circle. Yeah. It's because it was the same shit. And I was like, no. Because it's like, you're supposed to be dead. Death is the final thing. Like, what's next? Do you get to rest? What do you get to do? No. It's more of the same shit. I don't know. I know we're going back to where we came from, but I don't know where else to go. Oh, okay. I think this way. Uh, Yes, it is by the same people who made Until Dawn. Yeah, so this is from the same people that made Until Dawn, and they also made Man of Madan, which, so this is an anthology. I'm going the wrong way, because we already went this way. Yeah. Sorry, I'm a little lost, everybody. Continue. Uh, yeah, I was just letting people know that the Man of Madan and Little Hope are part of an anthology series, so they're kind of like Until Dawn, but like shorter stories. Is Twitch calling us losers? What's going on? Oh no, Twitch, uh, flagged the term losers. Oh. The mod caught it. Wait, is it this way? No, we went this way. All right, you know, I'm just going to go this way again, see what happens. Exit. All right, that's got to mean something. Where did we come this way? Ah! Is this supposed to be confusing? I'm not sure. Oh, no, oh this is where we came from. That's the- <laughs> Great. Good job, me. Here lies the body of Isaac Worrell, age 43. Re- Requies in pace. Pace. <laughs> is that a real word? Yeah. Okay, it, what is peace. pace? Ah. I, I, I thought it was just like old timey spelling of peace. No, the pace means peace. I think it means, it also means peace in Italian, maybe, because I, um, uh, a friend of mine had that in, like, one of their screen names. Alright, I'm just gonna go forward and see. Yeah. It means peace in Italian, as well as, I'm sure, other things. No, maybe I should just follow the signs that say exit and see where it takes me. Or do you want to look at the family plot? Oh. Is that tree going to have faces on it? Oh, please. I love it when trees are fucking weird as shit. I I like how we've been walking in the same circle for, like... This is a different circle, I think. (laughs) Yeah. No, it's... Fuck. <laughs> I'm going to follow you, this okay, sign. Okay, so, so the exit sign, I think, is pointing towards to, where you, to, to the exit where you want to go. I, that's probably it. But I just I was like, family plot. I want to know one more. Thank you for the cheers, Patty Shoes Change. I'll have a chocolate milk to you, Prost. Is that how you say that? Maybe? Angela taking them on a tour around the cemetery. <laughs> it's okay. I'm also lost, so it's not... Oh, 
What's this? Let's stay away yeah. from that bridge. I'm all for putting as much distance between us and that hideous thing as we can. Pretty sure Daniel and Taylor would be thinking the same thing. Oh. Out of sight, quick! Wait! Oh, shit. Okay. Oh, That's the bike guy. Remember, he was on a bike? Yeah. What happened to him? Oh, he's fine now. It retracted. Oh, and was he just fixing his bike? <laughs> All these people are like, uh. Best to keep out of his way, I reckon. That woman's final words keep buzzing in my head. To end what's happening in Little Hope, the little girl has to be stopped. Was she talking about stopping more witchcraft accusations or something else? I couldn't tell. Come on, let's go. I'll go in and take a look around. Oh, if we looked further in the graveyard, we would have found graves that of the family that died in the fire in the beginning. Thank you oh. for letting us know. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah. I always appreciate when people say that stuff like after we've played through the scene. Yeah. You know? like, yeah, after. So it's like we couldn't, we never would have found it, but we appreciate that you mm -hmm. told us. In the moment, it's a little bit too much. All right. <laughs> What's going on? Were they at any point brother and sister? We know that they were brother and sister. How, and that will... How am I holding up? Let's see. A radioactive mutant gargoyle tried to scarf down our classmates. Our leader, the professor, has turned into a boy scout. We're stuck in a creepy little shithole town with fuck you up fog. And there are way out of date wackos talking witchy bullshit all over. I'm real good. How about you? Truth be told, I'm still shaken up a little from the crash. Oh, how could I forget? We were in a bus wreck, too. Gets better and better. What's that noise? <laughs> Didn't hear anything. I don't know, sister wife. <laughs> I, your brother oh, husband, that's... will protect you. Oh, you want Witch to... trail is what it says. Let's go click on it. It might initiate something. Like a witch. Oh, this is interesting. Somebody says it makes sense if Taylor's unsure of their relationship. I don't like this. I want to, to go another way. Don't think there is another way. You know what? Since this is a no fucks given thing, maybe we should make a make out just to fucking be weird. Oh yeah, the, I I want to just just I want to I want a chaos playthrough. Just <laughs> chaos playthrough and then going Lannister is a little intense. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like when I first read of Game of Thrones, I was like, whoa, that's really fucked up, but, like, interesting how he wrote those two as they, like, literally think they're the same person, blah, blah, blah. Show came out. Everyone's like, let's have all the siblings fuck all the time in all shows. And I was like, can you try? Can yeah. you try to make it as good as Jamie well, and Cersei? And remember, like, Umbrella Academy, how, like, Gerard Way, who was, like, the guy who wrote it, he was basically like, yeah, I don't know why I wrote Adoption Incest. Um, I don't really like that part of what I wrote anymore. Yeah, I don't agree with it. He probably just wasn't thinking about it. 
Yeah, because it was like he wrote it a while ago, and yeah. I think like when people asked him about it more recently, he was kind of like, uh. So, I read A Song of Ice and Fire, and in the books, their love is like really toxic and strange. Totally. Um, and then in the books, because I know this is different from the show, because it checks, so it's not spoilers. In the books, Jamie leaves Cersei like permanently. Hey, over here. To you go gotta check find this out. Brienne. How do they say it in the show? Cersei? No, Brienne. Brian? Brienne. Brienne. That thing could still be around here. In the water. No, we left that thing way behind. We must have. But he leaves her permanently oh, shit. to Brienne. You're going first, right? You weigh half what I do. Better if you lead. I'm not crossing this crapped out bridge. No way. To find the others we got across. We got no choice. Fine. I'm heading across. You can follow me. If the bridge is still standing. Okay, then. Um, wait. Which one was... Uh, Daenerys. Oh, yeah. Okay. Um, but... Unfortunately, in the books, Brienne also gets killed by a zombie Catelyn Stark. <laughs> which was not in the show. <laughs> oh, yeah. And, um, which I was upset that they didn't, um, show in the, in the show. But zombie Catelyn Stark kills her. But then it's implied maybe sh Brienne also gets to be a zombie. <laughs> so, it's fine. What the hell is that? Yeah, in the books, Catelyn Stark comes back as a zombie because she gets kissed by fire. Mm -hmm. Because in the books, you can become a fire zombie, basically. Which um, Jon Snow becomes as well in the books, they're implying. And some people think that if you become a fire zombie, you can fight the White Walkers better or something. Huh, I like don't remember a lot of this. You see this? There's a lot. Writing. There's a lot in the book. <laughs> Which grave? This stone is believed to mark the burial place of the first person executed during the Little Hope Witch Trials. Let's get out of here. Oh! <laughs> Damn it! Get your hands off us! Oh, wait. I'll pick you. Mary? Mary? Mary! I am over this way! Mary? The fountain of all evil is here. That little kid is the evil here? I don't I don't get it. My beloved Amy proclaimed it so with her dying testimony. If this evil is to end, Mary must be stopped. Who in the hell are you? Why do you look just like John? I have no answers for you. Perhaps I'm already under a witch's spell. There it lies. I found it. How did you come by this? Fashioned with my own hand. I take it to protect you. Suspicion and betrayal walk side by side in Little Oak. No one is safe. Remember when that Please Asian guy was just randomly Let me keep there? It. In all of John's lives, he hates Mary, says rotted bits. <laughs> though because she's not in the current timeline who mary mary she was in all the other ones so she's probably just running around yeah being a weirdo it's your turn stacy mm -hmm. make everybody fight nothing no working phone anywhere okay so it looks like we really are trapped here still no sign of him Nope. Not yet. I just hope they're both okay. I figured we'd have found the bus driver by now. Wonder where he's at. Oh. There she is! Yeah. Why can't you leave Speak us alone? Speak of the devil, right. she shall appear. Ghost girl. I think she wants us to go after her. Apprehensive. You want to follow her? 
She could be leading us into danger, even a trap. The two girls we've seen. One is from the past. This one is from here and now. Maybe the girl we're seeing here is somehow a mirror image of the girl from the 17th century. Don't you want to wait for Daniel and Taylor? If they were coming this way, they'd be here by now. <laughs> Stay loose. Who knows what's up ahead? Stay loose. <laughs> hey, Stay hey, loose, yeah. bruh. I love it. I don't need their dialogue to make sense for me to enjoy it. <laughs> yeah, you see, he used to be a surfer. That's hey, his origin wait for us. story. You know what? Gotta cut loose. Cut loose. Shoo! <laughs> Ugh! Disgusting. Oh, no. Disgusting. Get off of that. Get off of that. Get off of that. No, she's gonna grab you through the grave. Guys? You there? Sometimes it does. Sometimes it's just like, figure it out, bitch. Yeah. She doesn't have her glasses either! <laughs> this guy's like, she's <laughs> gone. Shit. <laughs> just let no. her go. Well, sounds like she's already dead, so... <laughs> yeah! We should just leave. deserve that. It's just you and me now. Until Taylor and Daniel <laughs> get to us. That's what he said. Hey. Oh. oh no. <clears throat> There's something blocking the door. Give me a hand, will ya? Shit. This place is a museum that of That weird zombie's kind. after you, see ya. Yeah, she's down there. She in there? Like, Help! I can't... Hello? Relax. She's too far gone. This doesn't feel right. Stay focused. We're not having a rerun of what just happened to Angela. You sure about that? I'll do whatever it takes to keep us both safe. Once we're out of here, we'll hook up with the others. She's been That's your wife for like alive. three different lives, bro. You're kind of a dick. Oh, wow, look at those creepy things. Why is this kid out here on her own? It's strange. Maybe she's linked to Mary somehow? Gotta be. Though how and why, I'm not sure of yet. 
The New England Witch Trials. Seven ninety nine. It's a good deal for a book. Excuse me, why are you staring oh at the hanger? Oh my god. Do, oh, are those... It's probably a mannequin. No, no, the, they are mannequins, but they're, I think they're showing the ways people died. <gasps> yeah, because... Because they have the guy under with the, the rocks? Neck. Yeah, so let's see if we can find... Hey, remember... Disturbing. Wait. It creeped the hell out of me. Remember in the memory... Yeah, there was that, that we person were... who didn't have a face? Yeah, so I'm wondering, like... Did they really, did all that really happen? Or is like a demon manifesting shit and they didn't know how to manifest that? Hmm. You know? Hmm. Like if there's mannequins, did that really happen? Or was it like manifesting different scenarios? Mm -hmm. Does that make sense? Oh, all right, am I gonna walk up to that and it's gonna like fucking be weird? There's something to inspect over here. Oh, Amy Lambert, that's her. Amy Lambert, first of the accused. Amy was accused of witchcraft by the girl Mary Milton who claimed she saw her fly on a twig of willow. When told by the court that Amy had been seen by witnesses many miles away, Mary stated, I saw her lips ever chattering to who knew what and recognized her as a demon sent to me in Amy's form. Pastor Kava admitted this into the record as spectral evidence. Thank you for subscribing, 4 Joe. 23, 23 months. months! Woo! The enclosed puppet or doll is thought to have originally belonged hey. to a child in the late 1600s. Take a look at this. <laughs> I've seen this before. Where? On the road outside that shitty little bar we stopped at. Angela and me saw it laying there, picked it up. Right before that kid Mary scared us for the first time. Interesting. Suspicious. You think she maybe let us here? Oh wait, it's my turn. Hey. Oh, Wanted sorry. Us to see this? It's okay. Don't I completely worry. forgot. Like, what <laughs> I forgot too. I was like, wait. Who's yeah, that sounds right. Okay. Let's take a proper look. What the hell, Professor? There are many, many stories about how spirits can attach themselves to objects. So touch it. Sure, in movies. <laughs> take it easy, will you? What? Don't touch me with it. What if Mary's spirit is somehow attached to this thing? We burn it, and this could all end right here. No, that's gonna fucking piss it off. Look at it another way. Maybe by burning her precious things, it's just gonna piss the kid off. You might be right. I, I love how it's like you keep getting glimpses of the mannequins in the background, and it's like there's actually a reason for them to be here. So it's not just like, hey, like, what are these mannequins here? Like, they're in a museum, so it makes sense, but still, it's like creepy as fuck. It's like, cut it, cut it out, man. Oh, maybe some. Yeah, every time a secret's found. All right, that's great. Uh oh, something oh. creepy is about to happen. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I knew. It. I was like, "That's a window. Something is gonna be in the window." Uh huh. It would have been scary if it was just like a face staring at us. Oh my god. I 
Mary Milton, confess the truth of wickedness I have witnessed. Before the Sabbath day, Mistress Amy did, by the ash tree, commune with Black Samuel, a spirit in the form of a dog that spoke with the voice of a man. Then she spun three times round and agreed to serve the spirit and deliver the children of the village to it. Then she made a poppet and placed a spell upon it to curse those who would oppose her. These and dive divers fell divers foul things i have seen 25th of february 1692 simon carver oh i suppose i guess we really should have burned the poppet mm -hmm. this is the same trial we saw back in the police about. station people being disturbing me alike right and this kid mary who snitched on everyone that's got to be the girl we're seeing If a kid told me this, I would praise their imagination, not drown a lady. Yeah, well, <laughs> people were really, uh, uh... I think, in my opinion, is that a lot of the people doing the witch trials knew that nobody was a witch. And they just wanted to kill people and ruin everyone's day. Yeah. Well, I mean, we already know that people used to do it if they just didn't like someone. Yeah. <laughs> Basically, it was, that woman had an opinion. Also, her cheese got cheesy faster than everyone else's cheese. Is it witchcraft? Mm-hmm. Is it? Or, like, you know... It could just be, well, like, someone oh. being jealous. Um, have you ever seen... the oh, fuck. I can't remember what movie it's called... It's about, like, back in the olden times in, like, France, and a bunch of nuns went crazy and, like, uh, accused this guy of, like, communing with the devil. He was the priest. Mm -hmm. And, like, they all basically pretended to have this, like, massive delusion so that because, and they theorized that it's because the head nun, like, had a crush on him because he was really hot, and he, like, dated somebody else, and then she got pissed and, like... So they all pretended to have all these, like, crazy... What? what movie was that? I just watched it, and it's, like, based on, like, a true thing. Good for them for killing. I like it. I like that the nuns killed a man. That was cool. Well, I mean, they didn't kill him. Damn it. All right. That's no, no, no. They pretended to be, like, possessed by the devil, and that he, like, possessed all of them, and so they, like, ripped off all their clothes and, like, had an orgy and all sorts of crazy crap. That sounds like another movie I saw. But it's not the same movie. It had Audrey Hepburn in it. Um, not Audrey Hepburn. Aub Audrey Plaza. We can get out this way. Where'd that little girl get to? She let us in here and then disappeared. Maybe that was her plan all along. Lead us to the puppet. Job done. I'm not sure about that. It's called The Devils. Almost out of juice. No signal out here anyway. Just me and my sister, who was my girlfriend, but she refuses to be my girlfriend. So basically, you hear that? <laughs> Maybe. I had Heard casual something. sex. Not sure what. With my sister. Guys, professor, that you in there? But yeah, if anybody. Can we just get out of here? wanting to watch a super crazy movie from the 70s, they, like, cut out part of it because it was so... Where the so, hell are the others? Like, Probably as lost as us. Oh, it was from the you 70s? They're looking yeah, for so it's super Could depraved. Be. Angela's got no people, interest they, in they finding were, like, me. Weird. That's for sure. She's got a mean streak, all right. But she's got some heart. <laughs> you sure about that? Yeah. Known her for a long time. Longer than any of you. If you if someone says, "Oh, I got this movie from the '70s," it's kind of weird. I'm like, "Oh, how many bushes am I going to see? How many? Mm. It's not it. Right. I will see many." Ten bucks says no one's home. I'm not touching that. Still, 
First place we've seen in a while. Find a way in? Like you found a way into that store? You a burglar in your spare time? <laughs> no. But I was in a past life. <laughs> but yeah, there's like a whole sec section that's cut out of it and is like... Because the possession scene was like really... Oof. Not getting through this way. Sexy? I mean, no. sexual. Oh, okay. <laughs> But like it's it's like nuns and priests and stuff, which was why it was so like e. Now you can just like go on www.pornhub.com and just like do whatever. Um. Let's scare the shit out of our friends. Yay. I'm a bit lost. What is Mari telling us to do? Um, she's telling us, she's telling people to go on Orange YouTube if you have any needs. <laughs> I'm telling you, uh, if you are reincarnated, please don't date your sister. <laughs> like, I think that there was a thing where you could climb up by that window on the other side. Over it, here? Yeah, because when you walked by it, it said climb up. Oh, oh, oh. This thing? Uh, where was it? Oh, 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 oh. Yeah. Climb through the window. Oh, my God. I thought I saw something for a second. <laughs> no, click. For, eh, eh, no! <laughs> hey, Taylor. Check this out. Check what out? Don't think anyone's visited for a long time. Oh, yeah. And that's ten bucks you owe me. Don't owe you squat. I never took the bet. Fair enough. Yeah, but if you won, you would have asked for Sleuths. the ten bucks. I can jimmy this open, no problem. <sighs> you see how strong I was, sister? Oh, dark, we could have a big powwow about who goes in first. But we both know what's gonna happen. Right. Sure thing. She's like, go ahead, big strong. <laughs> ah! What the fuck? That's... Oh, Easy now, tough guy. Don't beat up the scary doll. Funny. <laughs> the way he Get went through that window, here. like, he would have clipped through the window. That's why the camera went down. Uh. <laughs> Come on, this way. <laughs> Everyone's laughing at me. <laughs> so are we not, um... These things look so real. They're freaking me out. <laughs> What's up? I just... I just saw something. I wonder if the two people can, two groups can be in the same space. Where the hell are you going? Not know where they are. Oh, and not see each other? Yeah. You sure yeah. this is a good move? Nope. <gasps> what? Are you not going to react to the gasp and squelching sound, sir? React to that. What the fuck? Have some reaction to what you just heard.
much to help me no more. Cast aside your false idols and pray to the one almighty Lord for forgiveness. Taylor! You okay? What's going on? What happened? I heard voices. I saw my fucking self looking back at me, dressed all weird, speaking funny. I mean, what the fuck? Pathetic. <laughs> Sorry I wasn't there for you. Oh, damn it, she liked it. This woman, the one who looked like me, they just dragged her out like some kind of criminal. I mean, shit. Let's get out of here. I hear that. Ooh, we're taking this. I found a knife. Maybe it was a knife once, when dinosaurs roamed the earth. Think we should bring it along? Here. You take it. Uh, why? It's obvious, dummy. Self-defense. You take it. You know, just in case. He's like, I can fight people off with my bare hands. Also, I just like, if you're the... <clears throat> If you're the bigger, stronger person, you should probably give the weapon to the smaller person? I don't yeah, know. Yeah, I agree. Like, he seems capable. Yeah. I mean, she seems capable too, but she's physically smaller. Yeah. So. I hate it when, like, I, when people I say that to, if they're a guy, they're like, oh, I thought you were a feminist. Yeah, I am, but I also think that some humans are smaller than other humans. Like, that's a normal thing. Yeah, well, there, there's such thing as just, like, objective facts, you know? And the fact is, women are more likely to be attacked by men, statistically. Because you're a feminist. Well, well, you know what? Do your part then. Oh, we already lost this. So this happened after the event, so it's not like... Hmm. Wait, what? What I happened after? I was thinking after? about when this happened. When, like, when in the timeline. Like, because we're both in the same place at the same time. Hey, check this out. The poppet's gone. Mm-hmm. The enclosed poppet, or doll, is thought to have originally belonged to a child in the late 1600s. Creepy. Shit, wait, I got it. This missing doll has got to be the one I saw with the kid. You think? That's kind of weird. Kind of weird? This place is full on nightmare central. I don't want to stay here any longer than I have to. With you on that. You know, another, like, if you wanted to look at it differently, you could also give the weapon to the stronger person because they would be more intimidating and could do more damage with it. So that's, like, also something to consider. I thought about that, and then I was like, no, just give her the knife. Well, I think it's also because, like, if you're... Come on, this way up. I don't know. I think it also probably depends on, like, who knows how to use it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like, in a real-life situation, you know? Like, if somebody wanted to hand me a gun, 
I've never shot a gun, so I probably would not want them to give it to me. I'd probably want it to be with a person who knows what they're doing. Oh, hello. Are things becoming any clearer for you? That thing, whatever it is, just keeps coming for Angela. Unrelenting. I do hope she's okay. They gave him some nice Another pants. instrument of death and a nice added butt. to the group's <laughs> collection. Good work. Thanks, Daddy. <laughs> Let me help you out. Give you one little hint. You know what? No. I want you to think I'm smart. No hint. Perhaps you think you can piece things together yourself. I'm sorry, I'll take the hint. The stakes are much greater than life and death. I hope you know what you're doing. I'll leave you now with some wise words from a great Irish playwright I once met in uh, Paris, I believe. <clears throat> Never judge anyone shortly. Every saint has a past. And every sinner has a future. She's just a child. Let's speak again later. I hate that guys who look like that are always like weird racists. So instead he, of just hot. He's talking about Oscar Wilde. He met Oscar Wilde. Mm -hmm. Daddy do you a juicy booty. Do you mind if I pee really quick? Yeah. Before we start? Okay. Mari, that's just how he flirts. Oh, okay. <laughs> But am I wrong in being fresh? I'm like, that. guys who look like that always look sharp as fuck, and they're always racist. Well, it's because they have that, that, that haircut is associated with... No, but the with... outfit, too, where they're like, I just have pride in my blah, and I won't recite anything they say. But then you're like, why do you have to dress so good? Dress gross. Not racist, just flirty. <laughs> Mari, that's my grandpa. <laughs> He looks like my old French teacher. Ho ho! No, it's true. <laughs> it's the armbands. Yeah. I get what you mean. They're either racist or the best people you've ever met. People, all right. There's a category of people who wear like the coolest clothes and have the best tattoos and are always like unbelievably hot. And they're either one of two things. An extreme racist where their entire personality is revolved around how they're racist. Or they exclusively only rescue pit bulls and have dedicated their lives to saving dogs. That's it. That's the binary. Those are the two things that you can be if you wear like weird, cool, cool old timey clothes with a lot of tattoos. Because racism is correlated with wealth. Oh. It's facts, exactly. I was telling them about the um, racist dog rescue, like, uh, spectrum. Oh, yeah. Like, with pit bulls and stuff? Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's like, there's no in-between. Somebody's either, like, an absolutely horrible person, or they're a saint. Stacy, people walk down the street. Is she racist or does she like dogs? <laughs> Which one is it? Mm -hmm. Like if I see a woman with her head is shaved, covered neck down in tattoos, I'm like, oh God, does she run like a rescue for disabled dogs? Or is her entire butt covered in the, in the or is, number 88? Or is she a Kat Von D Nazi? Yeah, like what is it? Cause, yeah, because you can either have Rachel to the rescue from Animal Planet, who's dedicated her life to saving animals and allows her son to call himself Fang because he's a furry on national television and accepts him 100%. <laughs> or you're Kat Von D. Like, you go, like, those, that's the, those are your options. like, I'm going to wear Nazi uniforms and photos just because it's hot. And you're like, 
Um, or you're Rachel from the re- to the rescue, where you travel across the entire country trying to find the most disabled dogs you can possibly find, and then adopting them. <laughs> That's it. Those are the two options. Looks like we've locked out here. Back on the road. The professor and the others can't be far. Hope you're right. We've been shit out of luck so far tonight. Rats are talent. like they wave pit bulls at Stacy like a racism dousing rod. <laughs> and you can't ask them how do they feel about dogs because racists the woman love who looks dogs. Like me. I don't know why. What did she do to be taken like that? I admit it's not a great sign, but you've got to forget about it. Move on. Oh, there is a plaque over here. Oh yeah, Rachel to the rescue on Animal Planet. She is an icon. Ew! Yuck. I'd be like, well, we can't read it. <laughs> yeah, the writers here readable. don't have happy endings. Sure looks that way. This house was the home of promising young author Tilly Johnson, famed for her gothic novel Tract of the Tethered, 1856. Tilly was mysteriously found dead at home in June of 1858. Little Hope Town Tourism. Congratulations on the Pizza Wii Player 7. Happy for you. There's a Sakura Blossom on there. That's weird. Huh? Oh. Look up. Right there, you see? Hmm. What I saw back there was unreal. I get that. But, but shit, this whole night has been messed up since we crashed. Sorry things are so shitty between us. That's not all down to you. Maybe not all, but we've been yanking each other's chains all night. I just pulled a little harder. Foreclosure bank owned keep out. This is the tourism welcome center. Was that another one of the same flowers? Yeah. Maybe it's a different flower and I'm just thinking that's what it is. Yeah. Does anybody know anything about flowers? They want to share some knowledge. Give me the flower deeds. Oh, looks like I shouldn't go here, so I'm gonna go. Veer point, viewpoint ahead. Oh! Where the hell is that coming from? I don't know. It's a beautiful spot right here. I'm looking at New England flowers just to see. <laughs> An archaeological dig here in 1955 identified a layer of ash and bone fragments. This site is thus believed to be the location where people were hanged and burned at the stake during the witchcraft panic of 1692. It is unclear which of the accused was executed here. Little Hope Town Tourism. Oh, they're talking about devotion in the comments. Mmm. I heard it was really good. We've tried to play it. Remember, I um, pirated it, and it wasn't. Maybe it's one of these. It wasn't your vibe. Oh, what's that? That uh, anemone. Some of them look like that. Some of the other ones don't. But there's a crow here. All right. Does anyone know where in Chicago crows hang out? Oh, so I'm looking to make some crow friends. Maybe it could be a violet. I don't know, they're shaped a little Maybe bit. it is a violet. Anyway. I 
I saw somebody play part of Devotion. I was like, I don't know if I would actually, I don't know if I would enjoy it. Is it too much? Scary. But that's not to say that it's a... Uh... Oh, somebody said, don't anemones represent memories? Oh! Very cool, very smart. Okay, I came up here... Oh, they can also signify fragility in Victorian language. According to both Greek mythology and Christianity, the red anemone symbolizes death or the act of forsaken love. What is the saddest flower? <laughs> oh, okay. Dude, The white what? stargazer lily. <laughs> I, I just, you know, you ever, like, look up something and then, like, the Google, the Google questions are too good to ignore, so you just, yeah. like, start clicking on all of them, like, well, what is the saddest flower? I don't know. I feel like you can get so much random knowledge by just clicking on all that stuff. This fence is impenetrable, just FYI. Ah, okay. We cannot get past it. <laughs> I'm not sure what to do now. Um, maybe over there? Oh, wait. It looks like you can get through. Oh, I didn't see that before. Excuse me. Can you not fast walk in front of me, asshole? What's that? Pretty sure it's a crow. That's a hanging tree. Get over here! Oh. This is impossible. I know those markings. This is my old tire swing. Look, here, see? Hey, hey, it's okay, it's okay. It's not okay, you don't get it. See these stars? I painted them onto this tire with my dad when I was 10 years old. No one else you has sure? ever done it. Hell yes, I'm sure. This is my tire swing. How come it's out here? Can't be. Just looks the same. It's just a coincidence. Wait, is it your turn or my turn? Your turn. Oh. You're a real dumbass sometimes, you know that? <laughs> this is no coincidence. This fucked up place is messing with me. Hey, hey, look at me. Look at me. We're getting through this, okay? Together. Oh. oh. See, I told you, weird man. <laughs> this is not my doing. You must help me. I beg you. Please help me before it is too late. Hush now, woman. Only the Almighty can forgive your sin. That is your only hope of salvation. Listen to me. I have committed no sin. The puppet I am condemned for is a child's plaything. Nothing more. I swear You'll not it. swear me. The sickness you brought into our midst must be purged. To free all of us and you from evil. You must burn. I beg you, stop. Do not do this. Ah! No, no, please, no. Stop. Ah! Ah! Pray, Lord, for you to take the soul of this, our sister Tabitha, who has been led astray by the devil, and do with it as you will. I wonder what the neck thing's about. Yeah. I wonder if this is about like... Oh, the woman we just saw. It was me. That, that means I'm next. It's a weird coincidence is all. Easy for you to blow off. I'm the one who could be next. I think uh, maybe part of getting rid of it, because remember we got that one hint where he's like basically let go of your guilt in so many words mm -hmm. and then he was like and also that little girl is innocent duh. Mm -hmm. so I think they're all victims like having to replay some sort of curse or something mm. and the real evil guy was that preacher who's probably like doing some demon shit 
And then just blaming random people and sacrificing them. To yeah. Them. Well. Let's keep on going to the church. That's likely where the rest are. What are you saying? Yeah, oh. sure, I guess. Right. Because also a lot of that, at least, you know, if you're the priest, it's about power and control. And like, so it's. Oh, it's a cat. Hi, cat. Protect us, cat. Help. Nope. Cat's Looks like here. we're being followed. We oh. are being followed. Hey! <laughs> get the fuck out of here! Back my fuck off, will you? <laughs> oh, that one's fiery. Oh, God, That's what the her fuck body. Is that? Come on. I feel like I did the wrong choice, but. being together. So I got like a little confused. It's okay, yeah. But honestly, I'm probably just saving them from themselves right now. <laughs> so I don't want them to be connected. <laughs> I want them to be separated. <laughs> what the fuck? You hear that? Is that Taylor? I wonder what his sweatshirt little emblem means. Taylor, that means something. is that you back there? Ooh. Get to the church. Run. Hey! One of those fucking things is after Get us! Get inside! Go! Come on, move it! Hey! Run! Get inside! He's like, that's your hey, demons, dude. That thing is almost on you! It's right on your ass! No, no, no. What the fuck are you doing? We shot at a black are man. You I'm crazy? sorry. You trying to get yourself killed? Get in here. <laughs> oh my god, we shot at him and then closed the door Where's Angela? on him. She didn't make it. Nothing we could do. You're kidding me. No, and we have to keep that thing outside or we'll be joining her. Fuck. Nothing we Look for ways done. in and out of here. Close them all off. Holy shit. Come on, we need a barricade here. Ugh. <sighs> Honestly, that guy that's out there is probably like, he doesn't even see it. He's hey. not even cursed. So he's like, I don't know what these people are doing. 
doing. Hey! Why the hell is that old fool still out there? Looks like he's following us. Oh, I don't. Whatever I, he's I don't want to know what's. We can't what, trust I know him. you're inside. If you hadn't lost your cool and taken that pot shot at him, maybe he'd be on his way. <laughs> he doesn't get how much my trouble fault. we're in here. Get out here and look me in the eye. But don't even think about going outside. You motherfucker, you! You take a goddamn shot at me. Quit hiding in there. Let him in. We have to get rid of him. We're in deep <laughs> shit if that thing hears us. What? No, I... No, I... Hey, cool it. I was... I was trying to help. Didn't you see that thing? What are you talking about? Ain't nothing out here. That thing out there killed my friend. Okay. So tell me what happened. Okay, we gotta be, um, like, mm -hmm. genuine. I don't want this guy Everything to die. Everything happened so fast. One minute my friend was right with us, then like that, she was gone. Taken. Gone forever. I sure as hell get that. Stay here. Don't move. What are you gonna go and do? Go get help. So he doesn't see that monster, probably because he isn't part of that group. Group. Maybe he has. Because we saw him morphing into a. You really thing think it was earlier. smart not to tell me that you had that gun? I messed up. I figured sure. I could hit that thing, but almost took out the old guy. I messed up. Having a gun puts you and everyone around you at risk. Professor? Andrew! Oh no. The guy called the demons. It's me. I'm next. What? Okay. The priest, reverend, whatever, made accusations against my double. It sounded serious. Another trial? Oh, we missed that. Not this time. It sure looked like it was heading that way. And the girl? Mary? She was there. But it seemed like she was trying to defend my double. We secure in here? You find any other ways in? Sorry, Professor, I didn't check. That thing is still out there. Look over there. We have to follow her. Whoever she is, she's tied up in everything that's happened here. What if you're right? What then? If we can stop her, it could prevent any more harm happening to our doubles. Okay. Guard the door in case that thing comes back. They just didn't, you know, like if we made choices that made us miss it. Yeah, I wonder. Maybe we, you saw that, right? Like how he's like all of a sudden he just says. Hey, kid. You out here? sister. It has nothing to do with witchcraft. It's just weird, bro. It pains me to say these words, but your punishment today will protect us all. Keep our town safe. Can you spare him? I beg you. This is hard for you, child. But one day you will understand and you will thank me. Go from this place, Mary. Your pleas cannot reach him. My fate is not a memory you should carry. Who will be my keeper if you are gone? Judge Wyman has instructed Abraham. He will be your keeper. A decision not all are in agreement with. Every man will face his death. Oh, of that's how he died in the house Yours too. Is today. No! No! 
Look, child. See who you would have me spare. See, he is no longer of this earth. Only the damned and the devil can resist in this way. Ooh, that's the knife. Like we're making it worse by like trying to help. Yeah. Like, oh, which is for sure confirmed now. Yeah. Oh, there's scratches everywhere. Look. I kind of like the implication that by trying to help we make it worse. Yeah. Because it's like, it's the same thing with other time travel games where it's like, or like media, where if you meddle because you're trying to help, you often end up just making things worse or harder for yourself. It is interesting how we're able to change the events of the memories. Mm hmm Are we going back in time for real? Devil loop. Or are we in some sort of like devil I don't know something just doesn't seem right mm. he was right here I was holding him he was right there nothing I could do Welcome to the club. Yeah. The I've seen myself get killed club would like to welcome its newest member. Say hi to Daniel, everyone. Ooh. Seriously? That's some real cold blooded shit, Taylor. Lighten up. <laughs> we do not need to be together. Lighten up, will you? We're going crazy here. I'm not doing any harm. <laughs> now we know the pattern. Angela was killed after seeing her double executed. Taylor had a narrow escape from that thing. You see your double get it, and you're next. He's the one with the spikes through That's it. That's real reassuring. Thanks for I sharing. Maybe. Maybe. Isn't it better to know what's going to happen to you? <gasps> there it is! That's what's been after us! We can't let it trap us up here. I wonder if they actually, like, face it. Like, we don't know if it's bad if they get you. Because remember he said like what let do we the do past now? go or whatever. That thing outside. Quiet. Maybe you have to face it. It's out there. Listen. It's out there for now. What if it decides to come in after us? Maybe we're okay if we stay inside the church. Because Because it's holy ground. A church? Maybe it can't come in. Really? It's a fucking vampire now? I'm just saying, this is a solid building. He's right. We're safer in here. We're staying put. That thing is hunting me just like before. It wants me. You don't get what we're dealing with. That thing out there is something fucking else. We gotta get away from it. Right? She's right, we need to split. We stay here and it's snack time for that thing. Whatever we do, we stick together. Remember what happened to Angela. Okay, let's do this. We're going out the back. Amen to that. What the hell is that? Another good reason to split. Let's go! Maybe those things have gone? Looks clear. Stay close. Yeah! 
his is the one with the spikes to it. You know what? I'm doing it. What do we do? I just knew he would fail if I asked. <laughs> yeah. What do we do? Uh. Oh, I'm switching to her now. I... Daniel! Oh shit. Oh no. Taylor. No, don't trust that voice. Do not trust that voice. I'd lost you. Maybe that's what the We're still in big from. trouble here. Oh! Because, like, it grabbed her around the neck. 